Alrighty, how's it going everyone? My name is Mr. Boss for the win, as you guys already know that, and this is going to be another episode of some Black Ops 2. Now today we're going to be looking at the pictures and some informations that I actually have on them. So right here you're looking at the quad road or prototype, uh, the one that was in FPS Rush's video, and the thing that strikes me in this video is that right on one of the propellers it says Charlene. Now the only thing I can think of is when the original Black Ops cover art came out, the guy had an M1911 that had Sally written on it and you actually figured out that if when you played the zombies campaign you actually unlocked a, a special akimbo pistol that shot like rockets or something like that so who knows if that'll play into the zombies storyline the campaign storyline or maybe even have something to do with the multiplayer so that's kind of cool how they sketched in the name right there that's the first thing I saw let's move on to the next image Okay, so the next picture we're looking at right here is the HUD of the killstreak that we just saw, the quadroarder prototype. And anyways, looking at it, to me, it kind of looks like a miniature gunship from Black Ops. Now, I get that because it kind of looks like you're going to be flying this machine on your own, and you can see it says tap LB for special button, tap RB to follow or something like that. So what I'm kind of thinking is you're going to fly around and you're going to shoot people, kind of like a mini gunship. So that's going to be cool. I'm going to be really interested to see how that turns out in the Black Ops too. And other than that, let us move on to the next image. Okay, so this mini tank thing right here is actually called the Autonomous Ground Robot. It kind of looks like the Assault Drone from Modern Warfare 3, so that's going to be interesting to see if that's a campaign-only thing or a multiplayer thing. It kind of looks like they would throw it in multiplayer because it doesn't like a, look like a too devastating kill streak. And in a second, I'm actually going to show you what is known as the claw uh, the cognitive land assault vehicle that's that giant star wars thing that i was referring to in my video trailer breakdown uh, there's a couple images of it roaming around it looks pretty lethal and pretty dangerous so who knows if that will be in the multiplayer just something to look at and those are the names for those two vehicles right there all right so the picture you're looking at right now is called the predator c avenger now to me it kind of looks like almost like a harrier variant from Modern Warfare 2, something that would be like a 5, 6, maybe 7 kill streak that wouldn't do a ton of damage, but that was really effective and maybe changing the tide of a game. It looks like a cool unarmed aircraft that you just kind of throw in the air with the flip of a switch or pulling out your cell phone. So that's interesting, and we will see a little bit later, maybe in the multiplayer reveal, how that's going to play out in the multiplayer aspect of the game. All right, so this fancy little handgun right here is actually called the Card, and it was made by a company, Chris, K-R-I-S-S, -S, and uh, it's a high-tech, semi-automatic or fully automatic pistol or machine pistol that could potentially have functions other than firing bullets. It will be interesting to use weapons in Black Ops 2 that might not even exist yet. So Nero made a pretty big deal about this weapon because he knew there was going to be something special about it. I think he was right. So it's going to be interesting to see what that pistol does in Black Ops 2. I'm going to be very excited. Or I guess we're just going to have to wait till the multiplayer to see more. And that is that. Alrighty guys, last two images. This gun right here is actually the XM8 prototype, the one you see in Bad Company 2. So that's going to be very interesting, a nice assault rifle that we've kind of identified. In Battlefield 2, I, or excuse me, Bad Company 2, I actually loved using the XM8 prototype. And that is actually being held by our main character, who you can see right now. Okay, and the main character seems to be holding some sort of high-tech shotgun. Uh, it's got three barrels on it, so I don't know if that's going to be some, like, super Dragon's Breath shotgun like we only saw in multiplayer and zombies, or excuse me, the campaign and zombies that didn't get into the multiplayer. We're just going to have to see. But thanks for watching, guys. If you liked the video, please like, and if you're new, subscribe. Always helps, and I'll see you in the next video.